could argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Pearl to Bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Bruce Lee, ready to battle and take home that elusive UFC goal. fight and all eyes are on the incumbent as he makes the walk here tonight and he's enjoying every moment of it. Huge title defense back in for him today. John, he loves where he stands in the sport. He loves the admiration that comes with being the baddest man on the planet. He knows he's the biggest, he's the strongest, he's the baddest and he loves it and he prepares as if he never wants to let that go. This man lives for being the best. This man lives to be in the spotlight. And time and time again, we see him defend this belt as if his life depended on it. Well, right, you lose this belt, it's essentially like walking back into your new life. He has no intention of suffering that fate. Your turn. All right, with that, the wait ends here. Both fighters have graced the octagon, and we are raring to go from a sold-out Eddie Hot Arena here in Abu Dhabi, UAE. Our tale of the day for this heavyweight championship fight. All right, now for the particulars inside the octagon of Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. It's a busy place. Fighting out of the blue corner. Presenting the challenger, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Herb Crusher. Herb Dean, Ready, our fight. referee for this Ready. one. Good. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training, and I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. Slips the punch. Oh, another huge kick is true. Able to block the punch there. Oh, they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Now some separation. Frantic pace early on to this one. <laughs> Trying to hammer that lead leg. Finish, finish. A beautiful shot lands the leg there. <laughs> right hook to the head block. What a punch. 
just missing on the high kick there. Oh, look at him snap off the jab. That's pretty to watch. Beautiful employment of the jab here. Oh, nice. Oh, good block there. Back and forth we go. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to, start to add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack. Not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now, and it's starting to show itself. Oh, he blocked that punch. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot, man. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, oh that was beautiful. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Straight right is there. Great job landing multiple kicks. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but it doesn't appear to. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. Really starting to pile up since he found his range. This could be trouble. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye and now there's a cut. But there's nothing to worry about too much now. But he's got to be very careful with it as we go forward. Pretty good connection there, yeah. Under a minute now to go in round one. Oh, with the over. That strike blocked by Lee. Oh, another strike to the torso right there. Gotta get better defensively, or that's gonna be a real factor as this fight continues. He's gotta tuck that elbow. Yeah. I mean, he's got that elbow flaring, and every time his opponent's going right up under and landing, right to the body. He's gotta do something different right now, or he's gonna get to a point where he will not be able to continue this fight. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that jet. First round winding down here. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the jet. Right. Round two straight ahead. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. You ready? You ready? Let's go. All right, round two. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His striking was money in that previous round. Got to think he'll pick up where he left off. All about the money. It was three backs, cash, dollar, dollar bills, y'all. <laughs> Every single strike he landed was on point. It was accurate, and it was heavy. Every time he let loose, he was able to land and land to great effect. Well, he's looking for that left hand, just out of range, though, with it. Both fighters starting to open up a little bit. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Oh, another beautiful body shot there. You see the damage starting to accumulate. Maybe some defense would be wise at this point in the fight. I think so, John. You can't just get beat up to the body. It doesn't show off. Strike lands there, and somehow 
His opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up. But you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Big right hand. Another stiff jab there. Really good use of that weapon. Not unlike he did in the previous round. Oh, oh he's got him hurt badly now. Oh! Okay, okay. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Oh, and he caught the kick. Fighters separate from the clinch now. Both fighters throwing heat now. Oh, huge kick to the leg. Combinations here. Somehow his opponent stayed up. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover, and it's almost like he let him off the hook. Kind of let him off the hook. He needed to really put his foot on the gas to try to find that finish. Well, you gotta think he might be trying to set up that overhand again. He's found a home for it all night long. Let's see if that holds true. Well, this is absolutely the hurt business. It's hard to see which party is more injured, but I think both fighters have been really affected with their strikes in this one. Yeah, both guys have been affected. Both guys have been beat up. It's oh, oh, how good is this? Both men going for the finish. Oh! Nice leg kick. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head, John. But the problem is now he's got some blood to deal with. He's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Oh, nice knee. Inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh! He hurt him again. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Oh, that head kick was nasty. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Oh, he's hurt back. but I'm not sure they're gonna be able to do much with that cut. It continues to widen with every passing strike. And you're fighting. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. 20 seconds to go round two. Oh, collar tie. Why right now they separate. Tries to work it into a takedown. All right, so the round is over, and you see the cut man not wasting any time as the fighter makes his way back to the stool. The cut man will try to shut that cut on the bridge of his nose and prevent it from becoming a factor here moving forward. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants to get the desired finish. You ready to fight? Ready. Come Here on. we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, so next round underway here, and you've got 
got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. Trouble's done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Beautiful combination. Overhand is good. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Lee's swelling now around that jaw area. We'll see if he can make some adjustments and perhaps defensively raise that. Oh, I think he's still compromised. We'll see if he can recover here. He's in a world of trouble. Big right hand. So it looks like some bruising on that thigh right now. He hasn't really done anything to address that weapon from his opponent. He's got to check some kicks. I know right now it may not be that damaging, but down the line, you're going to really pay for it if you don't address it right now. Oh, hard work pays off, lands the Superman punch flush. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off on him by blocking all these attacks. Slip that offering from his opponent. Oh, picture-perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Big head kick! Now we're going! He's really targeting that cut right now, and why not? He has opened up his opponent. Might as well continue to attack that particular area. Oh! He hurt a bad. Oh, a big left hand! We have crossed the midpoint of this one. What a display of physical and mental toughness on both sides. I'm not sure who's more injured, but they're both hurt for sure. Yeah, John, they're both beat up. But I think that is the key. The mental is what's going to allow you to get your hand raised in this fight. This will not be easy. You're going to have to go to some dark places whenever you're in front of a guy that is as good as you in every aspect of the fight. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Oh, nice one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, just misses with the kick. Sidekick, well placed. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Lee's nose is just donating blood by the second here. I'm not so sure that nose isn't broken, DC. Oh, that will end it, yep. Short time now in the round. Oh, How about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Well, at some point as a fighter, defensively, you've got to make an adjustment. His thigh is like purple now. Yeah, he's getting beat up. I, mean, I, I just don't understand how he could have taken so many leg kicks before he started to realize that it was going to put him in danger. Waited too long, now he's going to find himself in some trouble. One takedown is easy to defend. When you start stringing them together is when guys struggle. He passes the half guard. Wow, he actually reversed the position. The hits out there. He took a strong top position himself. All right, so the cut is getting out of control. The corner doesn't seem to be in any great rush to throw in the towel, but you got to think we're going to get some referee involvement here, sir. When we get to the stool, if we get to the stool, they're going to look at that cut and they're going to stop this fight. Because not anyone with a brain can look at that and know 
that this guy should not be in the fight anymore. All right, so the fighters head back to the stools, and hopefully this fight can continue. That is a severe cut. We'll see if the cut man can do some good work here. All right, let us re-rack some replays of the damage done in that round, see if we can isolate the strike that caused the cut. Yeah, a nasty cut opens up when he lands there. It's a beautiful shot that gets to the target. He has not been responsible defensively, and he's really paying for it because now he's dealing with that nasty cut. You ready to fight? Ready. Yeah. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. Fourth round is underway. What is the fighter's mentality when you enter those seminal championship rounds? You understand that you are getting close. His opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think he's going low and come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great fun. Lee's caught right on the bridge of his nose. Does not look good, folks. We'll continue to keep an eye on it. And you gotta think the ringside position will too. Referee might call him in here in short order. All right, so the overhand has certainly been a big weapon for him here tonight. Look for him to go right back to it here if he can find an opening. Let's go. Let's Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Oh, man, that could have felt good. Flush knee lands to the body by the taller fighter. Nicely done as he lands a kick to the leg. Well, some fighters, when they get cracked in the mouth, they respond well. He got stunned earlier in the round and hasn't really recovered or gotten back into things. People react differently, right? Some people just get back going. He's having a hard time building his way back into this fight. Takedown defense holds up. He's trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Well, this UFC fight is sort of dissolving into a horror movie. I don't need to see any more damage inflicted. You don't have to lose everything on one night. His corner can stop the fight now, and he would be mad now, but he would have... Oh! Oh, he got him again. Oh! Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Oh, and one more to the body for good measure. Slips. All right, so the body attacks continue to be the story in this fight, and looking really bad at this point in time, DC. Toughness only goes so far. And, and why do we have to rely on the toughness? I think right now we are in a position where the team has to start taking a look, where the official has to start taking a look, because sometimes you got to save the fighter from themselves. Surprised to see him rinse and repeat as he continues to target that swelling upstairs. Targeting that swollen eye, getting back after him, making him work, and recognizing like, hey, this is my path. It's working. I'm gonna stay on. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, he's gonna punch. Nose is just pouring blood at this point. You wonder if that's impacting his breathing by now. Nice punch. Oh, oh nice body shot. Big left hand lands upstairs. Oh. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. This is crazy round of fight. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count. Oh, what a hit kick there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh! Just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Lee's cut.
spot is only getting oh! Huge right hand! Oh, big ground strikes continue to land. Trying to recover full guard there. Oh, he passes the half. 15 seconds. Right inside his opponent's guard here. Nice guillotine that's up here. That guillotine is tight. Oh, how good is that as he gets out? That is great submission defense, keeping everything short and not allowing his opponent to get the submission victory. All right, there's the end of the round and hopefully not the end of the fight. He doesn't look as handsome as he did when he walked out. That is a severe gash on his face. All right, that is the end of the round and some definite adversity for him here, or so you would think the cut on the bridge of the nose is only getting worse. And that nose might even be broken at this point in time. So certainly something that bears watching as we enter this next round. All right, well, defense wins championships, and perhaps he can shore some things up there. Here are some replays from the damaging previous round. Well, he's got to. He's got to change some things if he doesn't want Ready. this cut to get worse. Good. But hats off to his opponent. His opponent found the target. His opponent knew exactly what he wanted to accomplish. Big strike lands. Now he's to chase down that Right, he targets the cut and lands a strike right on him. And he will let his opponent stand up here. Ooh, oh! Back and forth he goes. These two guys are straight. The cut men on both sides have done an outstanding job keeping these guys in this fight. Strong defense here as the hooks of the head is blocked. Oh, back and forth we go. Oh, big elbow. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough the opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Pressing here could be the beginning of the end. Shades of Robbie Lawler versus Rory McDonald as these athletes go toe to toe, both dealing with cuts and adversity and trying to fight through it. He's hurt so bad. He's got to find safety, find a way that you can recover. Oh, he lands a big left hand. Sports Center tonight. I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. Here now, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, nine seconds of round number five. We're playing the winner by knockout. And still, the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bo Crusher. All right, so heavyweight title retained is the headline inside this arena here tonight. Congratulations to the still heavyweight champ. Uh, once again, proven he's the elite among the elite. Heavy. In a division where everything can change in a second, this guy has brought consistency.